Okay, so this is the very first Iron Man challenge for Smite Duels. Uh, this would be the uh, Guardians, because if we did it with every single character, that would take years. Although, who knows, maybe we'll do that one day. So, you've heard of A, A to Z, all right? That's pretty common, but this is Iron Man, all right? Now, Iron Man, it's like a marathon, where it's like a little bit of everything. And somebody introduced it to Smash. And the way it works in Smash is you pick a character, or this is the way I understand it, because I've never done it before. You pick, start off with one character, and if you win, you go to the right. So then you play another game, you win to go to the right, go to the right. But if you lose, you go to the left. So theoretically, I'd have to win with Ares, Ardeo, Athena, Bacchus, Kabrakin, Cerberus, Fafnir, Ganesh, Geb, so on. And once I win with Ymir, I win the Iron Man. Now, if we were doing it so that I could lose the Iron Man, we would start with like somewhere in the middle. That way, if I lose with Ares, I, I just lose, lose. But since we just want to do finish every single character, we'll just start with Ares. And if I lose, then, you know, I, I just restart with Ares. There's no downside to losing with Ares no since I'm starting with him. But I'm thinking, all right, just to make it fair, that since we're doing it with Guardians, and Guardians are so bad, and we're fighting Vulcan, I need a little bit of a handicap. So I'm thinking to make it fair, if I, I, get, I get a best of three chance to go up, okay? So if I lose two games with a character, I go down. But if I win one game with a character, I go up. All right, that sounds fair. Because some of these gods, like Ares, you, you need like five games to win with Ares sometimes. So, I think, I think, I just think it's fair, alright? You guys gotta give me that, since it's Guardians. If I was doing this with Assassins or something, no, nah, it'd just be one chance and done. But let's do this, okay? This is gonna be a fun new series. I hope, really hope you guys enjoy it. I'm excited for it. So, I went Vulcan because I thought I was going against a different player. No problem, no. Joy Chef. Now... The downsides to this is that I got to upload the video no matter what. If I go 0 and 10, you guys are going to witness that, all right? <laughs> if I destroy my opponent, you guys are going to witness that. I usually don't upload games like that because I don't think they're as interesting. But there will be consistent content on the channel, and I know a lot of you want that. So consistent full gameplay is a little bit of everything, you know? Oh, I missed. That's actually really bad. I missed that. That's actually really bad that I missed that. I uh, could have gotten a lot of poke damage on him. I got to back up. Key with Ares is you don't, can't really clear the wave. You can try to focus your opponent down. But that doesn't always work. They get all three chains through the wall. Nice. I can't hit a chain in a straight line, but hey, give me a chain through the wall, no vision, and I got you. All right. Link is very good against Vulcan because he went behind that turret, that range he has. Shoot. The only good thing I can think about this matchup is that my three has knockup immunity. Or two good things. My three has knockup immunity. And when I get consistent chains on him, he can't use his main damaging ability, which is his backfire, because he'll be crippled. So those are two pretty good things about this matchup, you know? That turret is in a really bad spot for me to have to deal with. Um he's probably gonna get oh come on, he didn't shoot the minions. He's probably gonna get this already. Yeah. He's out of mana, though. Might be able to kill him. Oh, my God. I missed. I missed the most crucial chain. Yeah, I definitely would have killed him. Even with that bracer. It had I landed that chain. Because then he gets loaded. It's easy to hit the other ones. Wait, is he staying? I might be a blink on him. He does not have mana. Oh, he's back in. I can't let him back, you guys. I can't let him back. Where's he going? There we go. Okay. I can't, do not have enough time to take any buffs because I'm Ares. So we're just going to straight up back. I just realized oh, this man does not have beads. Oh my God. He doesn't have beads and he doesn't have a CC mute. Oh, this, how good would it be if we win the first Ares game? I thought we were going to be stuck on Ares for a while for the Iron Man challenge. What sucks is that Ardeo's next, right? So it's like, I'm not that good on Ardeo. Like, I wish it was a hard God and then a really, really easy Guardian for me to win with. Because if I lose with Ario, then I gotta go back to Ares, and that'll really suck. But like I said, I, best of three to advance because Guardians have such a hard time. 
So all I have to do is really land my ult while he's had like a little bit poked out and I can kill him. That's all I really have to do. Like right now he's poked out enough. Next time my chains are up, I just ult him. Oh, unless I just straight up die. Yeah. Uh, awkward. Does he have boots? No. Okay, he missed. I do have a health chalice, so I think I can heal up and try and kill him here. Oh, I want this kill, you guys! Alright. Do we just rush it? We just rush it? Rushing it? Used it for the. No, oh, the minions! <laughs> no. Dang it. If only my blink was up, man. If only my blink was up. The only reason I went for that was because he was so low mana. I knew once he threw those abilities out, he wouldn't be able to do much more. So, obviously, he did a lot more damage than I expected because full Bancrofts. Um, and it was a bad idea, hindsight 2020. But at the time, all right, listen, at, at the time, I thought I'd live with about this much health and he would have no, no, nothing in order, in order to do, like, any damage. Need to be better about these chains. Okay. He's pretty low. That's his bracer. We get a nice ult plus uh, chains. Whoops. Holy moly. Holy moly. Holy moly. I don't know where he went. Okay. Did I miss him through the wall? I wasn't... Well, either way, he stood still and let me escape. So, I'm, hey! Don't think of it as a wasted ult. Think of it as a distraction to let me get out, alright? It's not that I missed the ult. I missed the ult on purpose, you see. So that he would stand still and let me out. Perfectly calculated, alright? Okay, I got tier 1 boots. Let's go. Here's tier 2 boots. I might need to go speedy shoes, honestly. Just to dodge those meatballs. Uh, he's doing a lot of damage. If it wasn't for his damage, I feel like I'd be doing a lot better in this matchup because of my knockup immunity and the fact that I could cripple him. Uh, also, let's ignore the fact that Volk is my most hated god to fight besides, like, Kibo. So low, too. With full Bancroft, maybe? Yes! Roast is alive! How much did my chains do there? 634. All about those auto attacks in between. Without those auto attacks, I would not have gotten that kill. I would have died. So it's about consistently hitting the chains as well as the autos. Whew. Yeah, that gets my heart pumping. Alright, we can't take any... We might be able to take our blue buff. I mean, maybe. <laughs> uh, is he going Book of Thoth? Polly? Soul Reaver? Soul Reaver. He's going Soul Reaver. Is that, I would actually prefer that to be Soul Reaver than Book of Thoth. I'm not going to go that much defense. But if that's a Soul... Uh, if that's a Book of Thoth, his late game's going to hurt. Okay, let's back. Okay. Cooldown. Actually, cooldown since he doesn't have beads. Rather than move his feet boots. Let's do that. Okay. All right, Voidstone should be a must here. Uh, not only is Voidstone an amazing item, but it'll work well with our Spear of the Mages and, of course, Ares Passive. Rarely ever do I get to utilize Ares Passive. Uh, Jade Empress is another good item. Mystical Mail, not so much. Oh, I missed. He's not going to die here, but he's going to be low enough that I might be able to chase him down. right as I do that if he's crippled he can't use his one yes that turnaround though with the max bankrupt passive you guys no one was expecting that I wasn't even expecting that he can't use his backfire if he's crippled that's really nice for this match that's really really nice that is so helpful oh my god I can't believe that happened if I'm if I make another Aries montage that's going in it 
if I don't delete this full gameplay right after I upload it. I'll have to remember to save it. Or I could just download it from YouTube, worst case. 1,000 damage from chains at 7 minutes in. Wow. That is insane. That is crazy. And now we're getting our defense up on too. Okay, let's go back. I don't want to take shots from the turret. Vulcan is very good against melee gods, so, you know. Out. Okay, he backed up more. I have my ultimate. He does not have beads. No, dang it. That sucks. God, same thing again. Vulcan's so good at just backfiring out of stuff. Place his turret more forward. I hate using chains to clear, but sometimes you have to do it. Okay, he just wanted that buff. He can't use backfire if he's crippled. Good, good, good. He's dead. He's dead. Didn't get to clear the wave. This is good. We can push this wave in. Very good. That's worth it. He got red buff, but he, you know, he doesn't even get to utilize it. Oh, I'm so excited that this match is going well. Okay, come on, come on. We do need Polynomicon, though. I've always thought about going Imperius on Ares just because his, his tower push is so bad against physicals, right? But usually I'm just too far behind where I can't even afford to do that. Okay, we're getting that full Void Stone. Now we need to work on Spear. Spear, we will shred him. Also, I'm probably going to go upgraded eight. spear. I rarely ever go uh, spear, uh, sunder. Rarely go sunder nowadays, but I think against Vulcan, it's worth it because he won't be dealing as much damage to me when I'm chaining him and doing my combo just because he can't use his main damaging ability. Plus, if he knocks me up, I can just use my knockup immunity. Your middle tower is under attack. Is... Is it weird that I'm starting to think Vulcan is a good matchup for Ares? That can't be right. Even with that, Vulcan just... No, no. Does he have beads yet? Please tell me he doesn't have beads. Okay, he got beads. Well, we might as well burn him. Let's burn those beads. Nice burn beads. Okay. So those will be down for like three minutes or so. I don't know. 160? Yeah, a little bit. Three minutes. So, 12, whatever. I don't do timers. <laughs> I don't use the in-game clock for that kind of stuff. I should. I'll try and get a good habit of it, but not, not right now. Okay. A nice thing you can do with Aries, and it's very rare, is you can hug this blue buff wall and alt them through the wall. Uh, very rarely can you get it, but, you know, it's possible. It's possible. We are ahead quite a bit, which is pretty nice. Let's just keep that nice lead going, you know? Keep that lead going. Get his bracer. There we go. Wasn't really trying to dive him, dive him. Just wanted the bracer. Okay, now we might dive and dive in. Oh, I missed. Never mind. Sucks if you miss that, you know? Oh, I have my own for three seconds. Oh, he's doing so much damage, so I'm probably dead. Unless he misses this backfire. Never mind. He didn't even risk it. Uh, Vulcan's damage, man. He did go book of those. Shoot, man. That's going to be so much damage late game. Oh, let's upgrade this. Sunder. His beads will be down when I come back, but I don't know how helpful that will be. Actually, they'll be they'll be down for a little bit, but they'll be coming up. I'd have to ult him right as I get there with my blink. Right as I get there. And if he backs then, I'm not gonna get him. No, it looks like he's he's not staying. Tough man. That's tough. That is tough. 
Oh, Aries clear. So bad. Sucks that he does so much damage. I still don't have a spirit mages. Let's just pop get his beads again. Honestly. No, he actually, he actually didn't have it. Wow, I'm not doing enough damage though. Wow, unfortunate. I do have my blink. Ow. What is up with that turret, man? I could blink over him, maybe? Oh my god! <laughs> he damaged Boldy and Boldy came after him, and it was the perfect beat shield. It distracted him. Oh my lord, that was nice. This is so going so well. I'll be so sad if we don't win this, but I'm proud of this game. No matter what happens from this point forward, I'm proud of this game. Two missed air results, but everything else. Two calculated missed air results. Alright, come on. Minions become tanky. Did I do that last time? I need to make my minions tanky by using my two. Okay, let's get out. Right, he's got his defense, but we're about to get our spirit mages, so no problem most there. Is he chasing me? No, okay. Yes, he is. He's knock up me, Andy? Okay, just get out. His beads are up this time. I would love to burn his beads, but I think he would kill me if I do that right now. I would love to burn the beads. I can't. Okay, we're out. Oh, are you really gonna stop my back? Come on. Come on. Okay. I was gonna get my tower, but nothing I can do there. Now, I think I'm gonna get a gem of ISO. Look, I don't like gem of ISO, but <laughs> we are against Vulcan. All right, he's the ultimate kiting god. His passive gives movement speed. I need to slow him down, confirm those chains. I would also love a Kronos pennant, or even a Genji's if I do go double defense. It depends on what pen item he goes. If he goes up C, I'm not gonna go double defense. That Book of Thoth is gonna kill me though. It really is. Oh, he got, uh, he got that again. Oh, he used his beads, but he got pulled. I want, I just wanted to burn the beads there. Oh wait, I'm actually trying to kill him here. Is he not dead? Okay. <laughs> I was going to be like, are you seriously not dead after the Sunder and three chains? And with my Spirit Mages? We're doing the unthinkable, you guys. Oh, I should have level up my two so that these minions live for longer. I really doubt I'll get the Phoenix here, but uh, wait, we might get, we might get the Phoenix. Come on! Oh my God, we got the Phoenix. I'm getting out. You know what? Not even gonna clear these minions. Not even gonna clear the minions. If I die here, it's it's you know gonna be really bad. But if I live here, it doesn't matter if he takes every buff in the game right now. If I live here, that is a big win. I am a little bit scared of his ultimate, though. And he's getting closer with those, the backfires. Alright, looks like we're fine. Ho, 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 ho. How good is that? And just in time for, uh, for Jump Iso. Oh, I didn't talk about the Warrior's Blessing at the start of the game. Warrior's Blessing you get because you, you take minion aggro as Ares most of the game. And you're going to be focusing your opponent and taking minion aggro. It's mainly for the minion aggro. That's pretty much it. The Warrior's Blessing. Very good starter item on Ares. Wow, this is this is going really well. I love this skin too, by the way. Worth every cent. Even though it wasn't actually my money. Uh, one of my fans uh, and friends, Ness, he does art and stuff. He gave me the money to get this skin. <laughs> I wasn't good because I wasn't going to get it originally. 
But that was before I saw the, how good it looked in game. Oh, it's gonna blink there. I could just blink and all oh, his beads are down, and then just kill him. Oh, that bracer we're gonna need anti heal. But does it matter? It doesn't matter. Just play around those beads. He doesn't have a CC mute. Oh. Ares counters Vulcan, question mark, question mark. Can I get that clickbait title in here? And put it in all caps and the red circles. What's, okay, so he's dead for, I think this is game. What a good way to start this Iron Man series. Oh my God, you guys aren't gonna believe me that this is my first game as Ares too. I'll even show my history. Whoa, oh, I'm so excited right now. GG, man. That matchup's a lot better than I thought it was. Basically, any time I was about to die, if his meatball was on cooldown, I could just chain him, and he can't do anything except place a turret, and I could just walk around it. Like, he has no other way to damage me if his meatball's on cooldown. If he, even if he has a meatball, I could just use my knockup immunity and keep chasing him. That, I, I don't think this matchup would... I don't think Ares wins this matchup. I just think it's... Ares has some nice things in it. Vulcan's still the better god, but still. Uh, we are also in Diamond 5 right now, for the people on YouTube that don't know. Was a Masters last season. Let's look at my history. And there's my history. Yeah, so the full gameplay, Sylvanas, I just recorded and uploaded. And there's the first game of the Iron Man. So next Iron Man, we will be playing Ar uh, Ardeal. And I'll have best of three to try and win with her, or else I'll go down. Uh, I'm just going to say real quick, the gods I think I'm going to have problems with, Bacchus, big time. But luckily, Athena, I'm, I'm pretty good at with. So if I lose with Bacchus, I could just go straight back to him, which is easy. Now, Kabrakin, I'm going to have problems with. And since these gods are right next to each other, I'm going to be stuck here for a while. Cerberus will be okay. Fafnir will be easy. Ganesh, hard god next to Fafnir. I'm very happy that he's right next to Fafnir because then we can just uh, stay here until we win. Geb, I can win with. Yorm will be hard, but I can win with Geb very easily. Capri's going to be hard, so here's we're going to be stuck for a bit, but at least Geb is fun, you know. Kumba will be difficult as well. Kuzumbo will be another safe checkpoint where we won't be going back behind him, I don't think. Sobek, very difficult. Savannah's, I feel like I can get a win with him, so not too bad. Terra, pretty diff. She's good, but I suck with her, so we'll be stuck there for a bit. Jingtian, uh, probably, I'm like, probably can get a win. And then Ymir, you know, home run. If I lose with Ymir, that would suck. Home run with Ymir. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed the series. Have a great day. I'm, I'm pumped after that game. See ya.